big tonight. Haitian politicians started Wednesday creating alliances to lead the country crumbling under gang attacks that have shuttered the main airport and prevented embattled Prime Minister Ariel Henry from returning home. Politicians pursued new coalitions as Haiti remained largely paralyzed, with schools and businesses still closed amid heavy gunfire blamed on gangs that control an estimated 80% of the capital, Port-au-Prince, where several bodies lay strewn on empty streets. The country's two biggest prisons were also raided, with more than 4,000 inmates released over the weekend. One new political alliance involves former rebel leader Guy Philippe and ex-presidential candidate and senator Moïse Jean-Charles, who told Radio Caribe on Wednesday that they signed a deal to form a three-person council to lead Haiti. Philippe, a key figure in the 2004 rebellion that ousted former President Jean Bertrand Aristide, was repatriated to Haiti in November and has been calling for Henri's resignation. The Prime Minister has not made any public comments ever since gangs began attacking crucial infrastructure late last week while he was in Kenya, pushing for a UN-backed deployment of a, for of a police force from the East African nation to help fight a surge in violence in the troubled Caribbean nation.